Hello! Welcome back to Doki Doki, What Am I Doing With My Life? <laughs> um, so, <laughs> I don't know. This is... The Adventures of Jeffrey Part 2, where Jeffrey gets a name change. Yeah, pretty much. So, uh, this is this is my life as a maiden. Um, I'm Omega Goku, by the way, here with Joe Radio. Indeed. Um, and and as we're getting this started, I would like to take a moment to actually thank you, Goku. Yeah. For for giving me the opportunity to enjoy the this absolute cesspool of the worst the internet has to offer at times. Yeah, that's about right. And cool. I would also like to say that I could be at work right now. You could be, but you're not. And I don't know and... where I <laughs> Where am I? And by that, <laughs> I don't this? mean, like, I could be working right now. I mean, I could be at work, literally just drop everything to do, to co-commentate this game with you because I work a job where I can probably do that. Yeah. In fact, by the way, my manager would like to watch a montage of Doki Doki. <laughs> really? Well, I fell down some stairs. Or I guess this per I'm assuming this is me. <laughs> I oh, fell down a okay. flight of stairs. I have you have a confession in several broken oh, bones. Where is my son? Mom? Oh, <laughs> oh Nurse? My gosh. Calm down. <laughs> oh my goodness, my precious baby. <laughs> it's fine, mom. Oh so, gosh, this is this teenager's is... mom. <laughs> I didn't know you were being bullied this badly. Yeah. Uh please no bully. <laughs> Oh, we were yes. pushed down the stairs. Now I remember a few guys and girls were making fun of me at the top of the stairs as usual. Yes. Because of my feminine appearance and interests, I've been bullied constantly. So, oh yeah, so we didn't explain this, but basically, <laughs> <laughs> like the plot of this game is that Story. you're a guy that looks like a girl, <laughs> and you end up going to like an all girls high school for some reason. Uh, Which, yes. like, that, the logistics of that make no sense. Because, like, why wouldn't you just go to, like, change to, like, a regular school and just pretend you're a girl? That, you just, you just won the internet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, I don't know, right? Because, like, they, like, I don't know how it's actually going to work out. You don't ever have to go back to that school again. Thanks, See, the, the issue is, like, with my mother being a teacher, it's like, I know how a lot of this sort of, like, school selection stuff works, and how... Yeah. Oh, it's, it's Christmas! Christmas. <laughs> what would you do if you were tormented because you look like a girl? <laughs> That's I a would good... punch those assholes right in the face. That's a good question. What would I... Where did my mouse go? Uh-oh. Oh, there it is. Oh, I skipped. Oops. Huh. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I probably should have just watched that. Yeah. Oh, well. That's, that's fine. Nearly a year after my hospitalization, I was still at home while other people... Wait. So, a homeschool? That I, is, I suppose that's... I guess... Well, I did most of the housework. Felt better. So, I'm just like a stay-at-home mom now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> From what I've heard about the other... Students going to them have the same mentality. Why don't you just pretend you're a girl? Have you seen Oron High School Host Club? Because that might... I saw, like, one episode of it. Oh, yeah. All right, because oh. I showed you that one episode, didn't I? My parents can't move to a different city either because their jobs are important and they pay really well. They're both doing their dream jobs, too. Isn't that just unfortunate? Yeah. <laughs> it would be too selfish. Eventually, though, my mom had an idea for school after seeing a different side of me. Oh. Is that my mom? <laughs> what? Um. You do not look old enough to have a teenage child. <laughs> Hi, mom. <laughs> You've grown so beautiful in such a short time. Thought I was a guy. I'm so confused. And I, yeah, I, yeah. I don't have to hide my phone inside. I've embraced it for the first time in my life. Oh, jeez. Oh, dear. 
Now it's even longer. Uh huh. That was awful. Uh, why are we wearing makeup? <laughs> no. Oh jeez, this is this is. I I honestly don't know <laughs> what I actually got into with this. <laughs> oh dear. We're in this for the long haul. Like, I, I paid money for this game. I, I was just about to look it up and just be like, how much money did you pay for this? It was, I got it on sale. <laughs> That's my excuse. Okay, regular $10. Yeah, I got it on sale. <laughs> One uh, friend already owns this game. My dad and brother saw me in a skirt for the first time. <laughs> Both freaked out. Oh, oh gosh. All right. You and Kurt, they'd be shopping for more clothes. Is Dad still mad at you for helping me? He'll get over it eventually. Mm hmm. Yes. Are right, like... calling me Maria now? <laughs> That's my name now. Yeah. I, I don't get to choose a silly name, though. I know. Uh, that so... kind of makes me sad. Maiden's Heart Academy. A Christian all-girls school. Christian all -girls school. Oh, gosh. Okay, it's well this known is... for being a prestigious, strict school with well-mannered students. I, I have some experience with Christian schools, and let me tell you, they do lots of drugs in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am gosh. telling you right now. I don't doubt it, actually. The more how nice the students are, the more I wanted to give it a try. Said being surrounded by positive people. I'm nervous. Can I really fit in a school with fit in with a school of females? I'm not transgender, but you, yeah, but but you look but like you a kind girl. of are, right? Change my name, dress like a girl, and do a lot of girl things. But I'm I, still a guy, right? <laughs> I I feel like that's. I don't know what to I think, think we may actually have made a about that. But... <laughs> this game. Yeah. Oh no. They don't have any legal obligations to let someone like me. Mm hmm. She said it was a. Oh, she's your. She's the. I see. I see how this is going on. Ah. Is that mom got us in because she knows. You look and sound exactly like a girl. As long as you're well. careful, no one will discover. Yeah, it's not lying. <laughs> it's not lying if you don't tell them. <laughs> yeah. How do you feel about that? Because I've heard different stances on that. Right? Like, if you don't tell anyone that you did something bad, right, you're not lying to them. Yes. So, I don't know. I can't believe my baby's going to be living by himself for the next two years. Two years? In a, like a school? Jeez. Wait. Okay. But uh, I was at home for a year. Right? After getting a concussion. For so a year. Means... Well, first off, that seems So does that like... mean I'm just like 18 now and I'm going to graduate when I'm like 20? Yeah. That's kind of unfortunate. Yeah. That my mom is a lot more concerned about my life before she dismissed my complaints about being bullied, saying I was over exaggerating and not making enough of an effort to make friends. Uh huh. Well, so now we know. Good old mom watching out for us. Who are you? It's a person. I feel like we're gonna find out soon. Most of the students, it seems that they're. I recognize most of the students in grade 10 and above, it seems that they're. Wait, so are you talking to us? No, that's thought narration right there. Oh, yeah, yeah but no, it said I recognize them. As, as last year's student council president, it's my duty to welcome new students to our academy. Yeah, I think I think this is the yeah. student council president then. Okay. Uh huh. Why doesn't she have a name? I don't know. Right? Like, she has a name. Her name is Sylvia. Who is right? also her little sister. It's easy to tell that we're related. 
Oh gosh. This, I'm, not, this is... I'm not seeing a resemblance. What happened? <laughs> no. We can't be doing this already. <laughs> did I crash? What did you- What did you walk into? 